I'm going to show you my mom's trick that my grandma passed down to her. When boiling meat, and if you want the meat to be nice and tender, add two forks. And this is going to help the meat cook faster and tender. Now that the meat has been cooking for an hour and a half, I like to clean the foam. Then I add all the veggies, carrots, corn, potato, calabacitas mexicanas, repollo y cilantro. Cover and cook for another 20 minutes or until all the veggies are done. Oh my God, and I was forgetting my salsa de molcajete. I quickly heat it up comal, get the foil paper, and I just wrap it up so it can start sweating. And don't overcook the vegetables because I don't like them soggy. Beautiful! Once you get this beautiful char, remove the stem and transfer them into the blender. Add chicken bouillon and don't over blend the salsa as well. Give it a few pulses. Nice and chunky. Perfect salsa for your caldo de res. Serve. And lots of cabbage for me. Limoncito, salsa estilo molcajete. Y listo. And enjoy. Oh my God, this tetano is so good.